viral video of a Nevada judge being attacked by a man. You see it there jumping over the bench as she sat there is sparking discussion about safety in courtrooms. And one Birmingham judge believes it's helping further the discussion about funding for court security. Taylor Pollock is on your side tonight speaking with Birmingham's presiding judge. And Taylor, what does Judge Sparks have to say about all of this? Well, Brittany, I did speak with Judge Andre Sparks, who says acts of violence towards judges is happening across the country and that the video circulating online is drawing attention to a big need. Well, it was a really, really dangerous situation where somebody could have been hurt really, really bad. Video showing a Nevada judge being assaulted by a man just denied probation has shocked several across the country, including Judge Andre Sparks. As negative as the video clip that went viral is, uh, it does help forward the conversation that this is a serious matter. I mean, think about how many people are sitting in courtrooms on a daily basis. Everybody in there needs to be safe. When it comes to cutting down on incidents like these, Judge Sparks says court security is vital. It's the way you communicate with people. I believe it's um, making sure you identify issues early on. The security staff does more than just stand there and watch people. Judge Sparks says it seems like the one from Clark County that have also started discussions by the American Bar Association for more funding for court security. You know resources get scarce the lower the courts are. You have to make sure that the people who make those decisions are, are protected. And, and that's from the lowest court to the highest court. What happened in Nevada uh, is not unique to Nevada. Now, I did ask Judge Sparks what kind of charges this man in Nevada could face for assaulting that judge. And he says, while he can't speak specifically for Clark County in Alabama, assaulting a protected person like a judge is a felony offense.